And now Storm Tracker weather with meteorologist Michael Ottovino. Good morning and happy Halloween. What better way to celebrate than with a winter weather advisory that goes into effect today at around noontime. And this is for the Teton and Grove Out mountain ranges. Also includes the Upper Snake Highlands near Island Park, West Yellowstone, and also the Bear Ra uh, Range down by Montpelier. Anywhere from about 1 to 14 inches of snow is possible. Now, across Island Park by, and down south by the Bear Range, we're expecting about 1 to 5 inches for the Teton and Grove Out mountain ranges. About 8 to 14 inches of snow is possible. Now, this will We'll start right around the noontime today for Western Wyoming across Island Park and even further south. It'll pretty much dominate by about this afternoon into the evening into tomorrow. So the roads will be really slick out there, which is why that winter weather advisory is in effect. Let's take a look. Seeing those clouds already start to build into eastern Idaho. A pretty cloudy start to the day. Those clouds are really coming in from the northwest. And as we pan out, getting a look at that moisture, not quite affecting eastern Idaho just yet, but it will as we move throughout the day. That moisture located up north by Lewiston will slowly peak into the central mountains and then make its way into eastern Idaho and western Wyoming for some parts. I think for the Snake River Plain, we do remain dry for most locations as we move throughout the day. Let's time out all the precipitation on the future track around 7 o'clock this morning. Maybe a few peaks of sunshine to start off the morning, but other than that, we're expecting a lot of clouds in the sky. It'll be a pretty cloudy day, a pretty cloudy Halloween rather, for most locations. By about 2 o'clock, starting to see some of those snow showers make their way across western Wyoming, up by Island Park, across the Central Mountains, scattered mix throughout the day for the most part. And then as we move into about the 6 o'clock hour, notice cloudy skies across eastern Idaho. The rain and snow showers starting to build in across western Wyoming. And then even as we move into the evening hours, that's when we could even see some rain and snow showers across the Snake River Plain, and even across western Wyoming and the Central Mountains. But again, looks like we do remain dry for most locations across the Snake River Plain throughout the day. Rex St. Anthony could see a rain shower, even Idaho Falls later on this evening into the overnight, and that chance will continue across all locations for the overnight. Now, temperatures right now are actually hovering around freezing for most locations, not even seeing any temperatures above freezing across eastern Idaho. It's 29 degrees right now in Pocatello, 30 degrees in Idaho Falls. It's 17 degrees right now in Jackson. And as we move throughout the afternoon, it'll be a pretty chilly day out there. Temperatures only in the 40s across the Snake River Plain. Most locations actually in the 40s for the Central Mountains, Western Wyoming, generally seeing temperatures in the 30s. It'll be 39 degrees today in Jackson, 40 degrees in the afternoon, and it'll be a chilly one when the kids are going trick-or-treating later. And it'll also be pretty breezy out there. We could see winds between about 10 to 20 miles per hour between about 4 and 8 o'clock tonight. Temperatures in the 40s, a cloudy sky. I think we could see a chance of a rain shower probably across Idaho Falls by about 8 o'clock for tonight. And as you look ahead to all locations for the overnight temperatures, mainly in the 30s, rain showers are possible for the Snake River Plain. Higher elevations could see the chance of a mix. Central Mountains, Western Wyoming will see rain and snow showers. For the seven-day forecast across Pocatello, high temperature of 56 degrees tomorrow with a mainly cloudy sky. Chance of rain on Friday, partly sunny on Saturday. Across Idaho Falls, high temperature of 53 degrees tomorrow, 57 degrees on Friday. Friday, chance of a rain shower. It will be pretty windy out there and partly sunny on Saturday. Across the Teton area, Jackson, Afton, and Driggs, unsettled weather, weather with a chance for rain and snow both today, tomorrow, and Friday, and across the Central Mountains. Expect rain and snow showers today, chance of rain tomorrow.